is Sandra, and welcome to Bookworm Delectables. Today, I'm going to be doing a recipe from The Constant Gardener by John Lacar. The idea for this recipe came to me when Justin Quayle, the main character, is thinking about his wife, Tessa, and he's recalling when she's serving these shortbread cookies to his boss, Sandy. The thing is, is she's serving them on a silver tray. And so he would recall that, you know, they would sit down together and Tessa would have this, um, this feeling of guilt would come over her because she was serving these cookies. It, because blocks away, there were starving people. And I mean, to serve cookies in a silver tray just didn't seem right to her. She helped people. That was her thing. She wanted to always reach, reach out to people. If someone cried help, she wanted to be the one who was there. She gave a lot of herself to people. And when she saw things that were wrong, she wanted to see them corrected, especially because she understood exactly what was going on and she wanted to fix it because she saw that the people were helpless. So she did what she had to do. She loved helping people. And the fact was, even when Justin is recalling this memory, Justin loved his wife because she loved to help. He didn't realize actually how much she loved to help people and how much it really meant to him that she did help people. For the cookies, you will need three quarters of a pound of butter or three sticks unsalted and softened three quarters of a cup granulated sugar one teaspoon vanilla extract two cups all-purpose flour and one cup cornstarch we're going to combine the softened butter and the sugar in a bowl And we're going to cream them together. In another bowl, um, mix together the flour and the cornstarch. Whisk it all together. The dry ingredients into the wet ingredients. Form the crumbly dough into a dish shape and refrigerate for two hours. Preheat oven to 350 degrees. Okay, I put the dough on my board and I'm going to see if I can roll it out. I want to roll it out to three quarters of a centimeter. I've lined a cookie sheet with parchment paper. Over here, my dough was too crumbly, so I added more butter to it. It's really supposed to be, um, if you don't have eggs or um, some type of liquid that, uh, such as this one, which is mostly dry ingredients, if 
your dough isn't moist enough, you need to add more butter. If it's too moist, you need to add more flour. You should cut these cookies out with a small cookie cutter. Here are my cookies, ready to be decorated. Um, when I baked them, I did bake them too close together, just so you know. I'm using black and yellow for three bees in the Constant Gardener. It's my royal icing. I'll just oops. Here are the finished shortbread cookies. If you're interested in corporatism and espionage, pick up the book The Constant Gardener by John Le Carre. You'll really enjoy it. If you like this video, please make sure to subscribe and give it a thumbs up. Comment down below for things you'd like to see on my channel. Have a great day, and thanks for watching. It's time for munchies. That's great.